Alright, what's good, YouTube, Facebook, Tumblr, and Twitter? It's me, P, the PBKM, and I'm actually doing another movie review. This time it's a movie called Blunt Force Trauma. The name is horribly misleading. Because uh, I thought it was going to maybe be a zombie movie or something like that. With the name like Blunt Force Trauma. But actually it's about gunmen. Um, and it's not even an awesome movie about gun, gun, you know, gunmen. But um, it's kind of like watching the tech and cutscenes and endings made into a movie without touching any part of the game at all. So, it's a nice idea, but it kind of sucks. But, here's the deal. There's this guy, and he's a gunfighter. And what he does for a living is he goes to um, like illegal gunfights, like they're illegal ones. And he participates. And they wear vests and whatnot. And they draw little circles across the arena and whatnot. And they stand in the little circles. And the idea is to actually use your gun... To knock them out of the circle. So it's like sumo wrestling meets gunfighting. Literally. So the whole idea is he's really good at it. Because he's got this really like kick ass revolver. That just like knocks people back. So in a couple of shots he usually wins. And every other shot is just keeping them out of the um, circle again. Well of course because there needs to be a woman to make this more awesome. They bring in this female gunman who does the same thing, but she's out on this revenge vendetta to beat the guy who killed her brother by accident in their gunfight. Um, basically what happened, and this is where the title apparently comes from, is um, in one of these gunfights, the bullet hit the vest, but happened to rupture his liver, and he died. So, back to the young guy. His storyline is he wants to fight like this legendary good at this shit gunman that's like retired where he doesn't even come to the matches anymore so people have to like come to him and he's got this like lady who can lead him to him and whatnot okay this is how it works um they basically go through a little adventure all this is in south america and what it basically comes down to is she finally meets the guy that she wants to kill turns out somebody pops him and he died in one of these competitions and that's pretty much where she exits the story, more or less. She reappears, but supporting character more so than anything else. Anyway, um, his mission still isn't over. But, um, because the lady who, um, when we first see him at the first fight, tells him he needs to actually take some blows, because he's actually been doing real good without ever getting hit. Sorry, but I'm thirsty. Because he's really that fast. So, the cool thing about all of that is, is um, he goes, he does what he needs to do, and he actually gets shot like a handful of times in various um, altercations slash matches, where he actually like gets shot, I think, a total of while he's in the vest like nine times, and they leave the bruises like all over his chest. So the lady's pretty much like, oh, you took some dings. Oh, okay. Well, you can totally go fight him now. Okay, so he goes to fight the guy, and the guy basically breaks down. He ain't want to be a legend in this. He really doesn't care about it, but, you know, he's pretty much looking for the guy that may or less take him out. But he doesn't want to be, you know, like the dragon everyone has to kill or anything like that. And he looks like a techie character. Like, he looks, he's wearing some shit I would see Lee where in like the Tekken series seriously but anyway like he might be in the next Tekken like seriously anyway so basically they have their gunfight but it's without vest gunfight and you know they black it out on us where we don't know who won but if you watch the credits you can clearly see the winner walking away because they're not dead um but all in all yeah, it was an okay movie um, for people looking for deep metaphors and meaning and stuff, it's probably one of those kind of films, but for me, it was kind of boring. I kind of need explosions and stuff, because I'm basically a big kid. But, um, pretty much, that's it. 
Um, as usual, um, like, click, subscribe. That gives me motivation to do more videos. And I'm going to even set up where, you know what? If you want to talk about this, feel free. If you want to go see it and chat about it, you know what? I'm going to start posting some of these on the forum too. The actual reviews so you don't have to go hunt for them. Because I'm that nice of a guy today. Just for the day though. Um, and of course, um, go by the website, www.amway.com slash pbkm store, where you can buy stuff from Amway through me, because I am IBO, 4919392, and I would highly appreciate if you support my business and help me make some money, especially if you love to drink access, um, get vitamins, or even take the, um, DHH, um, filled, um, fish oil or flaxseed. Oh, that's probably somebody like my BFF trying to contact me. At any rate, though, I'm out, folks. Have a good one, and um, can't wait till next week.